You're positive you don't want to come over and talk. No, the gun battery is nice and quiet. If I throw down some rugs, it'll get downright cozy. Garrus? I'll be fine, Leora. Just gathering some thoughts. All right. Hello again, Shepard. What have you been up to since we last saw each other? Since you helped me defeat the Shadow Broker, I started looking for defenses against the Reapers. The Protheans were the only ones with substantial information on them. The older civilizations barely had records. I knew the elusive man was hunting for the same thing when our agents began crossing paths. Like on Mars? I thought I'd covered my tracks, but he had surveillance there all along. What's been happening with you as the Broker, Liara? It's been... exciting. The old Broker's ship? Impressive, but it was never meant to be space-worthy. Which meant the elusive man eventually tracked me down on Hagalaz. What happened? I knew he was coming. Ferran and I loaded as much of the ship's specialized hardware onto a shuttle as we could. We got away from Cerberus's ships after arranging an appropriate distraction. What kind of distraction? Sending the Broker's ship exploding into a Cerberus cruiser. I don't think the elusive man expected me to give up my resources in such a spectacular fashion. Can you still operate as the Broker without the ship? Well, I couldn't let the elusive man have it. I saved what was crucial. My network of agents is intact, although the Reapers have taken a toll on their numbers. It's taking a while to re-establish contact. So where is Farron if you two escaped? He convinced me he was recovered enough to work. And I do need more agents. Agent Farron didn't report any injuries during his last call to you, Doctor. True. Given what he survived, I should probably worry less. So is that drone your new secretary? Glyph is a VI shell that indexes my search functions on the data feeds. I couldn't work without it. Although, I'm lucky Edie let Glyph on board after it tried to rewrite her scheduled tasks. I was merely attempting to standardize the ship's automated systems to our own, Dr. Tassoni. Yes, that's precisely why you're confined to the cabin. How much do you know about this Prothean artifact? Very little. We're fortunate enough data survived to piece together the blueprints. Decoding them will require as many specialists as we can find. It's that high-tech? I'd have killed for a glimpse of it during graduate school. We'll talk later, Liara. Of course. <laughs>